entering the sports science lab are two of the top receivers in the draft. TCU's Josh Dotson and from Ole Miss, Laquan Treadwell. Before our testing begins, we wired them up with next-gen motion capture suits and state-of-the-art eye-tracking glasses. At 6'2", with a 41 and a half inch max vert, Dotson has a catch radius within about 2% of the catch radius of Des Bryant. But his size and rock-solid hands weren't the aspects of his game that surprised us. What impressed us the most was his acceleration. In the NFL last season, fewer than 10% of receptions went for at least 25 yards. That's why at Sports Science, we test how quickly athletes can hit their top speed. And when we put Dotson through our 20-yard acceleration test, he was able to record the highest top speed and second quickest time to top speed of any prospect we tested this year. While Treadwell also has the size to dominate NFL defensive backs, his best attribute might be his vision. Eye tracking data reveals that with a heavy bag barreling in, some receivers we've tested shift their gaze away from a pass with as much as 40% of the ball's flight remaining. Treadwell, on the other hand, consistently keeps his eyes fixated on his target for nearly 90% of its flight. Studies have shown that longer visual fixations can improve motor skills like catching and can actually block out excess stimuli such as an incoming defender. And that laser-like focus is paired with 33 and 3 8 inch arms. That's as long as the arms of Calvin Johnson. With that kind of frame, if Treadwell has a defender pinned in the end zone, just to get a finger on the ball, the defender would have to have arms as long as Kevin Durant's. After putting these receivers through position-specific tests, we rank Dotson as a talent similar to San Diego's Keenan Allen. And Treadwell compares favorably to Houston's DeAndre Hopkins. And while Treadwell isn't known as a burner, his ability to burst off the line may surprise some NFL cornerbacks. In our acceleration test, he had the fastest time over the first 10 yards of any receiver we tested in this draft. For ESPN Sports Science, I'm John Brinkus.